Now, Mr. Slovin will interview two prospective employees. Many lessons to be learned here. Ladies, please pay close attention. Hello, and thank you for coming in today. Well, hello to you, too. <laughs> hello, and thank you so much for taking the time to see me today. The best boss I ever had, I would have to say Gloria in the kitchen right here because uh, she's really organized and she plays real good music. My greatest strength, I'd have to say, is my positive attitude <laughs> and my aptitude for rote memorization. I see something once and I got it down. I use my time very efficiently. I'm almost never late. She was late today. For example, in my old job, a long-term client was about to take his business to a competitor. I was able to meet with the customer and change the way we handled his account on a day-to-day -day basis in order to keep the business. I think it's important to have close, intimate relationships with your coworkers. It's good for morale, you know? Okay, that's like a fact. It was lovely meeting both of you. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Slovin. And may I say, what a privilege it would be to work for the Philip Morris Corporation, a company that has remained the largest cigarette manufacturer in the U.S. since 1983, plus has increased its dividends 46 times in the last 44 years. You all tore this market up in the face of a world that was trying to tear you down. Now see, that's the company for me. Yeah! Yeah! yeah. Thank you, Ms. Jefferson. Yeah, yes, let's, let's hear a round of applause for Ms. Jefferson and Ms. Gonzalez.